Hi, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Vlogmas. I literally hate recording. <laughs> you can do it. Good do night. Good night. Let's see it. Good night. Hey. Good her night. Her name is Shay's own day. And nothing's getting in her way. A pencil might come on over. I. <laughs> Does anybody want him? Like, I'll be happily package him, ship him off for Christmas. <laughs> Anyways, today, instead of doing like a vlogmas kind of thing where I vlog all day, um, to be honest, I'm still not really feeling that well. So that's why I sort of took advantage. This package showed up at my doorstep yesterday. Um, and I really wanted to film first thing in the morning, but to be honest, I was really, really excited to open it. So I just decided to film a little bit early and then be able to take like the rest of the day off to kind of recover and whatnot, but still have a video for you guys. We do have Jeffree Star's mystery box. And I always screw this up all the time. I don't know if this is the pre, I know it's not. I think the deluxe is the one, the biggest one. I, I always forget what the premium, I can't remember if the premium is the smallest or the second largest, but I got the second largest this time, which I'm really excited about because the last two mystery boxes that I've done with Jeffree Star, I've gotten the smallest box, which, spilling some tea here, I am part of like a Facebook community of like, we talk about makeup and stuff, and somebody had posted that they got refunded for the smallest mixed mystery box because people were really unhappy that they didn't, that their exclusive item was like stickers or something. I don't know, I didn't read too much into it. This is the one time I did not get the mystery box, the smallest mystery box. So apparently people are still gonna receive their smallest mystery box, but they got refunded for it, which I mean, Kudos to Jeffrey, of course. I think he's a great uh, business owner and takes care of his customers. But um, yeah, I was a little blown away by that. So, but that's not what we have today. We have the second largest box. Whatever that is called is gonna be in the title. But before we open up this, I did wanna show you guys because you might be aware that my daughter collects nutcrackers and when my son is here he'll also co like we'll start a nutcracker collection for him um and my nutcracker collection is currently i should say my daughter's nutcracker collection is currently at my mother-in-law's i thought i picked up all our boxes but i think the majority of them are there so like we have two out right now but my mom just found this one <laughs> And she looks like a little, I don't know, maybe, uh, yeah, a ballerina because of the shoes. But hopefully it's focusing. But <laughs> she's super cute. I really like this one. And she's like none of the other ones that we have. Um, so I always write like Ella's name and then the year that she got it. So I have to write that on the bottom of here. Um, but again, she has two nutcrackers over there. So we're gonna, we're gonna add this to our collection. So Ella gets all the female nutcrackers and then of course we'll start a male nutcracker collection for Hunter. That actually started because my youngest brother um, they started doing that for him. We're about five, basically six years apart from one another. I don't know, none of us older kids had like the Nutcracker collection, but when my mom started this tradition for my youngest brother, I always loved it because seeing the Nutcracker collection grow was so much fun. So I'm really excited to add her to the collection. So I just wanna show you that to make sure that I did and I didn't forget and I just kinda put her away. I am excited. I'm super tired and again, I don't feel too hot but I don't feel sick enough to not open a Jeffree Star mystery box. I've never been disappointed in these. Um, I actually get really, really excited for these. I have one more package coming from Jeffree Star because on Black Friday, this is technically kind of like a Black Friday haul because I bought both packages on Black Friday. Actually, no, I think these went on sale Thursday, but they were the Black Friday mystery boxes. I think they went on sale on Thanksgiving, if I'm not mistaken. But then the second package, which is, ow, which is coming in a couple of days, which will be in another Vlogmas, was purchased on Black Friday. That's why I'm calling it a Black Friday haul. I have a window behind my tree and I thought I heard something. Spooky. Don't start scratching my couch arrow. <laughs> oh my God. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Make sure we're recording. Okay, because the last time, oh my god, the last time I opened a mystery box, I wasn't recording. 
and it, it sucks when that happens, especially with mystery boxes, because it's like, <laughs> you can't really fake your genuine surprise. Um, so inside we have like this green kind of emerald wrapping paper. I just get really excited. Okay, so those must be the stickers that were mentioned. Oh, I see something big and I'm getting excited. So, okay, first of all, <laughs> oh, these are funny. Okay, even if you got like the sticker, these are funny. <laughs> okay, I'll just show you these really, really briefly. Um, I can't say some of the words on them because I'll get demonetized. That says family, family friendly content. <laughs> um, but yeah, these, I mean, these are cute. I don't know what I would like put them on. I'm trying to think of like if there's anything super, I was going to say like a mirror or something, but I don't know. I'm going to hold on to them until I actually have like something to put them on. Um, okay. So it looks like there is, <gasps> Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. So it looks like there was two big packages, but then I removed this and I found two liquid lipsticks in here as well. So I at least see including the stickers five products so i'm just gonna i'm just gonna take everything out real quick put it on my lap so i can make sure that we unbox everything so we have the green tissue paper and then on the bottom we have the red tissue paper and that is the empty box so we'll put that aside um i kind of want to open up oh my god y'all if this is like i kind of have a guess as to what the big thing could be and if it is I might actually explode so I think we're gonna start from like smallest and work our way up to the bigger products so with that being said we're gonna start with the two lip products these are both oh yes I'm actually really excited these are both velour liquid lipsticks and I love liquid lipsticks same kind of packaging. It has the hot pink packaging with the stars. I know I have to get my nails done, <laughs> but one is called Queen Supreme, which I feel like, like that's such a familiar, maybe he's used it a bunch of times. I don't know, but it's such a familiar. <gasps> oh, that's gorgeous. Sorry, these allergies and heartburn at the same time. It was such a familiar like shade name to me. I've heard it a bunch of times, but it says gorgeous like almost i don't know if i want to call it a lavender like a lilac like it, it looks purple in the tube like a light purple oh that's so pretty so i did just a quick swatch for you guys don't mind my tan my fake tan but obviously it would dry down matte oh my gosh that is gorgeous i love that color i'm not even gonna lie um and then the other one ooh. This must be one of the exclusives because it has a little tiny uh, stocking and then it shows like a question mark. I wonder if this could be like ho, ho, ho. I know he had like a range of maybe five lipsticks that he came out with for the fifth anniversary. Ooh, it's red. Sorry, I just dropped my iPad. Thought I cracked it. I got really scared for a second um do this okay so the shade names this definitely like on the bottom of queen supreme it does have the shade name but then on this one it just again shows the stocking but i was watching i think it was graveyard girls unboxing of the fifth anniversary and i think that this could be ho 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 um but it's not giving me a name but it's a really pretty red but it has like with gold sparkle in it. So there is the mystery red shade. There we go. So it definitely, it has glitter, but I think it'll still uh, dry down to a matte. So that is really gorgeous, actually. Really, really perfect for the holidays. Um, I would put it on right now on my lips, <laughs> but my lips are super, super dry. I've been like combating them the past week. So, um, but you'll definitely see me wearing that because I do love rocking a red lip. So, so far, so good. Um, love the lip products. Those are both products that I would use. I could see some people being a little bit nervous about the purple shade. It is a little bit bold and daring, but I feel like in the springtime, like that would be stunning. Honestly, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be afraid to wear that. All right, next product. Oh, we got a liquid 
Frost, which I've actually never tried these before. This is in Goddess. So this is his one of his liquid highlighters. I love the color too. So here is the packaging. Oh, does it have like a pump? I'm really, I'm not sure. Whoa. Okay, hold up. <laughs> Sorry, this is my first time experiencing this. So I twisted it and that popped up and then you pop it out. Oh, it's like a little dropper. All right, I'm gonna just disperse a tiny bit into my hand. I love this color. I, I think like, oh, oh, I love bronze, like bronzy colors. <gasps> oh, that's stunning. Oh my gosh, especially I'm tan, like been tanning the past year, but like in the summertime, oh, oh. I love that. It's drying down really fast too. So it does have like some sparkle in it. Oh, that is so pretty. I mean, I feel like that little drop covered a lot of space. So you would need a tiny amount um, to actually highlight. I'm sort of obsessed with that. I've again, never tried it. Um, the liquid frost before, but I love the packaging. I love how it like pops up. I just think that's so cool. I don't know, really like that. So third product is awesome and now, the big boy. <laughs> okay, so we have this neon or navy blue, I should say, big packaging. And the only reason that I'm like kind of guessing as to what it is is because it's big and bulky. Um, and I'm kind of afraid I'm gonna have a heart attack if it is what I think it could potentially be. Um, so we're gonna just on camera together, okay? I think I can see it from the side. Oh my god, I'm gonna have a panic attack. <gasps> Wait a minute, I don't know. Okay, now I'm not now I'm not sure which one it could be. No, it's not! Yes! <laughs> yes! So oh my god, I'm so excited! It's the blue blood. <laughs> you looking at me? It is the blue blood freaking palette. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I'm so excited, you guys. <gasps> oh my God. Are you ready for this glory? Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Like, I'm so excited. I am so excited. I am gonna run up and tell TJ and he doesn't even really care that much about makeup, but like he knows how excited I get. <sighs> oh my God. God, I have been wanting this palette for such a long time and I just kept not buying it. And I, oh my God, I'm like so excited. I know it's just makeup, but this like, this, this gets my blood popping and mm, oh my gosh. Okay, so it has a latch, which I love. I've always loved the packaging of this. Can we please just, oh my. So for those of you who might not know, I adore blue and green eyeshadows. I love doing looks with them. I don't know why. I've always gravitated toward them. Oh my God, the ma <sighs> this is so gorgeous. This is the first time I've looked at it like in person. I don't even want to touch it. I can't even believe it. I cannot even believe that this came in the pal. Are you kidding me? Oh my gosh, all right guys, I am a little shook. <laughs> I literally have goosebumps right now. It could just be the heartburn, but I am, oh my God, like this is gonna go on my table. I don't even wanna throw the box away. It is so beautifully packaged. It's the end of the night, please excuse me. I am dying, I am absolutely dying right now. I am gonna run up and tell TJ, Happy Vlogmas to us. <laughs> I will probably always buy the bigger size of Jeffree Star's mystery boxes now because I am obsessed. I think I paid $60 and I think this alone goes for maybe $54 or something like that. I could be wrong. Uh, we'll, let, we'll price check that. But I think this is about like $50 something dollars and then... I don't know how much these go for, but I'm pretty sure the lipsticks go for like 18 or something each. So 
you're getting well over the va value of this box. They freaking send me that palette alone, I would have been ecstatic. Um, and then of course you get the extra um, personalized stickers as well. So I'm a little, um, oh, okay, I need to go breathe. <laughs> uh, it's probably because my nose is stuffy too, but I am actually obsessed with this box. I am really, 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 really happy with it. So thank you guys so much for watching today's Vlogmas. I'm dying a little bit inside. I am so excited. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh, I can't wait to play with it.